Madison, Wisconsin is literally the birthplace of satellite meteorology. NASA was gonna put a telecommunication satellite out to this geostationary orbit. Professor Vern Sumi said, can we put a cloud camera on there? And that's where the birth of satellite meteorology in the geostationary perspective was in 1966. It's really been a long evolution of improvements from the early days when we had one visible band and the field of view was approximately four kilometers. Fast forward, go 16. 16 bands, not one, half a kilometer spatial resolution, not four, and images as often as every 30 seconds, not 25 minutes. The rapid imagery lets you to almost see it as it's happening, and of course that gives you more lead time for saving lives and property. If you drive, walk, fly, fish, hike, go to a football game, you're gonna be safer because of the GOES-R data.